Hi guys, welcome to another video on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to export your YouTube short in Filmora 11. Okay, so I will give you some tips and tricks on how to make a short in this program. Okay, let's go. All right, so for example, here I am inside my Filmora 11 and we mentioned that this is the latest version of the software. It is Filmora 11.7.6 and some people ask me hey Jackie is there any new update in this version and for me I, I don't think there's any news update here by the way there are some small changes in the new version for example if you click at the media and now we don't have the share media anymore uh, they rename it to global media so it is the first change in the program and secondly they bring back the free option for example when we select the the effect we will see a free option right here so we can see all the free effect that we can use for our video okay so these are some small chance and i think it's just the same with the previous one just rename the this folder and i have no idea why they just doing that okay so for example here i have a video here a project here uh, which is my youtube short and the tips here is to create multiple short video on the same timeline so this is what i normally do because the short video is just about 20 or 25 seconds because it is up to one minute by by the way i just want to create 20 seconds or 25 seconds so i can create the same format with the uh, title and video transition and also the voiceover and the same music so i create all of them on the same timeline so something will look like this and for example i have three video here the first one the second one the third one but they are the same i just show you an example of how i create my short video okay so for example if i want to export this portion uh, meaning that this video okay the first thing we need to create a a free account or we need to purchase a license of Filmora 11 in order to export the video okay so we have to log in to our account so this is the login button and I'm going to use my account and press enter and press next and then I'm going to type my password okay it will successfully log into my account and then I can export the video. And being mentioned that if you want to purchase Filmora license, don't forget to use my 20% discount coupon code in the description. And you have to go to Jackie News and then cut the coupon and then click the buy now button and paste the coupon there. Do not just copy the coupon and go to wondershare.com and then paste the coupon. It will not work. Okay. Uh, so for example, if I want to export this video, so all I need to do is to highlight all of them. So this is the video that I want to export. And now I can press X on my keyboard to select only this portion for exporting. Or I can right click at this portion and then select clip range. Okay, so this is a shortcut X and uh, I can click here. And now I can export this one. And if you don't select the portion here, then you have to adjust the in point and out point. For example, I can cancel this one. And if you just put the playhead here and without selecting anything, if you press X and then it just come in the, the in point and out point. And now you have to adjust the in point and, and, and out point. So this is very annoying. Okay, so let's cancel this one. So I'm going to press Shift X to cancel it. And for example, I want to export this portion. Okay, so we need to highlight them. And then we can press X on our keyboard and it will select, select this portion. And now we can click the export button. Okay, and the next thing we want to select local. And for, for uploading to YouTube, we want to select MP4 right here. And then I can give it a name, a short example okay and then we need to select the location to save our video in this case i will save it to my desktop and i'm going to create a short video here Filmora short okay and then i can select this folder and click select folder okay and the name and location is okay and the next thing we want to 
click here at the setting because normally the default setting will be 8000 kbps and the video quality is not very good okay so just click here at the setting and now you don't have to do anything here and just double check your project setting this project is in 9 by 16 and 1080p and the frame rate is 24 frames per second and for the bit rate i want to increase it to 20,000 kbps and that will make my video better okay so the performance of the video and then i want to save this preset for next you okay just click here to save and now i can create a youtube short preset okay preset reset okay and then i can click save and now we can export the video and being mentioned that do not check this box auto highlight or otherwise it will create a small video on your computer okay and upload to cloud and add to project media do not do not check anything here okay and then you can click export and wait a few minutes maybe one minute or or less than one minute because normally a short video is very short so it is only 20 seconds or 25 seconds and the the computer can export it very fast okay so it finished and now we can open our folder open the folder so here's a short example let's double click to play it if this is your first time to vietnam and you want to try a local food restaurant Find this fish cake restaurant at number 5 Chung Yen Ding Liet right around Huan Kim Lake for 45,000 Vietnamese dong. You will get a bowl of crunchy fish cake like this. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to know more about Vietnam. Okay, so it is very nice, right? And very fast also. Okay, so that is how to export a short video with Primora 11. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you are new here, consider to subscribe to my channel for more video like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.